Oh yeah, the bitch is gold. to Vet p &E. Happy Thanksgiving everybody as today is a turkey day over here in America you know I'm not clued up on the history of things and all that lot but you know I got to think it oh what way are we thinking oh man blank at the moment oh yeah that way American holidays. You know, I need to look up on the history of things and all that lot. But um, correct me if I'm wrong. Thanksgiving's down to the pilgrims. You know, coming over to America and all that lot. Which I'm guessing, you know, I'm saying pilgrims from Europe, England, and all that lot. You know, and that's how Thanksgiving started. Correct me if I'm wrong and all that, but well, you know, I'm not too sure, but you know. But then again, what do we have on 4th of the July? we got Independence Day, which is celebrating the independence from England and all that, but. Well. So you got 4th of July, celebrating independence from England, which were uh, whatever fucking war it were, I don't know. And then you turn round, middle of November, turn towards the end of November, whenever the fuck it rolls around, you've got Thanksgiving. But it's giving thanks to all the pilgrims and all that lot coming over. Which, to me, that's like saying thank you to me for being over here. And everybody's having a big meal and turkey cooking turkeys and whatnot, you know. Maybe having maven noodles, I don't know. Depends if you've been invited anywhere or not like that. Thanksgiving to that saying, thank you to me for coming over here, which I appreciate that everybody, but, you know, you're kind of a, what the hell, you got 4th of July saying, yeah, we got rid of all the fucking English and all that, what, and then you turn around and say, thank you for us all being here, what the hell are you all thinking, America, that's what I like to know, what, what's everybody thinking? How do these holidays come around like this, you know? Personally, you know, I feel grateful that everybody's saying thanks to me for Thanksgiving, for being over here, you know? And that's much appreciated on my part. But, you know, looking around on my YouTube channel at the moment, I'm not seeing many Bordeaux blogs, so, you know, maybe I can inspire a few people to get out in the cold weather, riding the bike, you know? It's, pretty dry. Yeah, it's cold while you're riding around. You know, we're coming up for the polar bear challenge starting in a few days time. If I remember right, that's starting Monday. You know, maybe I can inspire some people to get out, get on the bikes, do a few vlogs, you know, and give me a history lesson on the back, you know, while you're riding around on your back, you know, tell me, explain to me. The history of America because I haven't looked into it you know it might be a good topic for everybody to get out and do you know it might be a bit controversial what I'm putting out here and all that lot but you know if I can inspire somebody else to get out on the bike maybe join us on the polar bear challenge you know who knows it might be a good time I'm not saying go out when it's roads are full of ice or out like that you know each to their own. If you feel it's comfortable to go outside and ride on the bike, you know, go ahead, go out, ride on the bike. Put up a blog. 
Give me a little bit of history about America. That's all I'm asking people. Because, you know, my way of thinking, we might be screwed up. I might have done too many drugs when I was younger and all that. Like, I don't know. But, you know, one minute you're saying, yeah, you got rid of us fucking English. Next minute you're saying, yay, yeah, thanks for being here. Hey, that's my little bit of a vlog for today, you know. Especially on Thanksgiving, you know. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. I do appreciate everyone and all that lot. And yes, we are getting ready for the polar bear challenge. We got a little bit of wind today, you know, the body's pretty warm. I've got me textile jacket on, my gloves. And all that lot, you know, what more do you need? I know some people have put heated grips on the bags and all that bullshit. Oh, uh, there's just one thing I need to go get. A new thermometer for the bag. This one's fucking crapped out. I need to go get a new one. This is only a few bucks, but I can pick that up at any time. But gee, it is getting a little cold out. I say we're running around at 37, 36, 37 degrees today. This first time the old girl's been out in a long time. For a good run anyway. Girl still got some power in it. She just needs a good clean out before we come to do the polar bear challenge where I'll be pottering around town and all that lot. You know. Just to do a few minute videos here and there, you know. Make sure I get under that 32 temperature mark. You know, my main aim this year is to just qualify and be a polar bear challenge rider. And then we'll take it from there, you know, once I get them three rides in. We'll take it from there, we'll see what happens. 